Hi there, I'm Anita Kaiser, and today I'm going to lead you in a tap along to help you connect in more with your authenticity. We're going to do this as a call and response. I'm going to say something and then you're going to repeat after me. And so before we begin, I invite you to check in and to notice how you're feeling about being you right now in this moment. So I'm going to actually give you a sentence that I'd like you to check in with. I'm free to be me. So I'd like you to repeat that out loud and put a number from zero to 10 on that. And 10 is, I am super free to be me. I feel so comfortable. And zero is not so comfortable being me in this moment. So decide where you are on that, write it down. And we're just doing that so that you know what's changed for you. All right. And then when you're ready, we're going to begin on the karate chop point, gently tapping. Even though it doesn't feel safe to be me. Right here, right now, I'm open to looking at this. Even though it doesn't feel safe to be me in this world. Right here, right now, I'm curious about that. Even though there's a part of me that doesn't believe I can be me. I'm open to noticing what's going on with that. Just allowing yourself to notice anything that's come up for you already, any thoughts or ideas around these statements. There's no right or wrong. There just is in this moment. And then when you're ready, we're going to move to in between the eyebrows, in between the eyes, gently tapping. It's not safe to be me. Outside of the eye, right on the bone. There's so much judgment in the world. Underneath the eye, right on the bone. People don't want to know the real me. Underneath the nose, it's not safe to be me. On the crease of the chin. I don't like the idea of being so authentic. down to the chest. People just use it against me. Underneath the arm, it's not safe to be me.
All right, taking a moment, placing your hands on your heart. And just checking in with that statement, free to be me. Just noticing whatever there is to notice. Maybe the number has shifted, maybe not. And then when you're ready, back in between the eyes, on the bone. I wonder, outside of the eyes, what it would feel like to be more authentic. Underneath the eyes, I wonder what it would feel like if I didn't second guess myself. Underneath the nose, that sense of freedom. On the crease of the chin, the feeling of carefreeness. Down to the chest. This idea of being more authentic. Under the arms, I'm curious if it's safe for me to be more authentic. Shaking that off. Bringing your hands back to your heart. And just checking in again, noticing whatever there is to notice. Thanks for joining me today. I'm Anita Kaiser. I'm a coach who works with empaths and highly sensitive entrepreneurs, and I hope that this has been helpful for you. Have a beautiful day.